Yeah! yeah! Good morning, Jericho Middle School. Today is Wednesday, April 29th. It is a day two. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Here's the flag. I am holding a flag. If you don't have one in your home, uh, Amazon is still selling uh, flag stands, if you wish. And interestingly, that's how the pledge came to be, was through selling flags. All right, here we go. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please be seated. We're so, so we have, uh, to have Mr. Gleason, who knows uh, arcane facts about the uh, origin of the flag. Uh, tomorrow, he is going to tell us about the history of toast. Yes. Uh, <laughs> celebrating birthdays today are Omar Abakush and Hannah Ng. Happy birthday oh, to both. Let's make this the best birthday of your lives so far. And uh, one club is going to be meeting today. That is uh, the Mathletes 2 Club with uh, Miss Eats. And if you're interested in joining that, you can get the link on Canvas this morning. The Amateur Dentistry Club, however, is canceled today. So those students are looking forward to that. I'm sorry. That'll be uh, – have to look, look, look forward for that, to that again in the fall. So we've got, we have some guests with us. Tell us how you're doing with the quarantine, guys. Well, I am doing a lot, a lot. A lot of cooking, um, <laughs> a lot. My son, my middle guy, he's a 10th grader. He's funny. Yesterday, right before I went to bed, he said, Mom, you were shackled to the kitchen again today, huh? I said, yep. Shackled. I was shackled. Yeah. So I'm cooking and baking and cooking and baking, repeat, cleaning, dishes, repeat, work. <laughs> <laughs> right. I feel like I, I feel like I need a, a repeat of my family and consumer science class because I've been sewing homemade masks and doing a lot of cooking over here. Ah, excellent. Have you made that uh, homemade mac and cheese recipe? I haven't. I haven't. Oh. I have a memory of your class is mac and cheese. Yes. <laughs> I think we're all going to come back to school 50 pounds heavier. It's almost unavoidable. <laughs> unavoidable, I think. How about you, Mike? How's it going? Everything's going well. Thanks. I have, uh, you know, I have my little home office for all the Jericho things. My wife's in her Oceanside office on the other side of the house. <laughs> and my kids are in their East Meadow offices up in their rooms doing their <laughs> online learning. You have three school systems in you underneath that's one right. roof. That's right. I, but I know for over the years, Jericho, we've always been number one in the snow days. <laughs> so, <laughs> there have been days where I'm off and my wife has to go to work and my kids have to go to school. Those are, those are the greatest days. Yeah, my kids say that to me a lot too. How come I you have off and we don't? I said because in Jericho we care. <laughs> <laughs> we care about your. We care about the safety of all of our people. Jacqueline, how are you doing? Good. I am also baking a lot. <laughs> I made some chocolate chip cookies again yesterday, uh, which is a problem. But it was nice out, so I also went for a run. Nice. <laughs> nice. I did a super fun virtual scavenger hunt this weekend, and we had to do all these like silly, fun tasks. It was very fun. You did it with adults? Yes. <laughs> I know you had done it. You did it with your classes last week. That was such a fun idea. What was oh, something yeah. that the kids had to get? They had to get something that made them smile, something they wore on their head, something that was a rectangle, very and then they had to find an area of that rectangle. Yeah. No. How about you, Janice? How are you doing? You're muted. Yeah, I know. I I thought that's what I was supposed to do, following you, directions. You are. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm doing well. Pretty much the same thing. Cook, clean, watch a lot of television. I'm I fun do a run. Teachers are asking me if they can continue some of the features from remote school once we return, especially that mute bu that mute button. <laughs> the kids are asking me the same questions. Dr. Gailey, can we use it to mute you? I'm like, no. <laughs> so, Chad and I have been having fun. We started doing, um, we, uh, we're having orientation sessions with each fifth grade class. So yesterday, each day at the uh, we've been meeting with a different fifth grade class to talk about what they can look forward to in middle school. So those sessions have been a lot of fun, haven't they, Chad? The, uh, we put a Kahoot in there yesterday and we asked them about their knowledge for, uh, yeah, Chad, you're, you're muted. You're muted also. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I was just saying, it was great to get to see all the kids that we're going to get to see in September. So it's nice to meet everybody. It's a lot of fun. And they've got a lot of personality, those kids. Yeah. Ooh, what are they asking? 
That is code word. <laughs> are they asking questions? <laughs> what are they what are they most anxious about? Well, what they seem to be most anxious about is I think they think that I'm Dr. Fauci and not Dr. Gates. So <laughs> you know, they asked us many questions about masks and when we're returning <laughs> to school and, and social distancing. So I've been telling them that Chad is working on a 26 day uh, school system <laughs> where you in school by the, the day of the alphabet. So, uh, yeah. Uh, that and locker decoration, I think, are the two uh, biggest uh, issues. Locker decoration. <laughs> We promise that somehow, some way, we'll get that stuff out of the lockers that's in there now. So we are working on a plan for that. So that, that's the big thing, right? Lockers, they love it. Yeah, yeah, that's always a big thing. I love lockers too. It's job security for me. <laughs> that's a big part of Janice's gig. Right? Yeah, yeah. All right, guys. So listen, have a great day. Uh, we're gonna We're going to sign off. This is how it works. All right. Uh, let me, I'll drop our quote of the week in there. Our quote of the week is make it work no matter what you have to work with. That's by Steph Curry and our SEL team of the month is hope. Have a great day, Jayhawks. Good to see everybody. Make it the best uh, Wednesday of the week. Yeah. Right. yeah. I, I swear to you, if, if I didn't hear Chad say the day of the week in the morning, I would not know what day it is. Yeah. I rely on Chad to tell me what day. The, and I don't mean the number day. Right. Wednesday. <laughs> it's like and when you're retired, every day is Sunday, my friend.